The Chaka Cha is a Japanese automobile. It basically means chatter, but it sounds like people chatter. There are two simple rules for Chaka Cha. 20 slides, and each slide automatically advances after 20 seconds. Those are the basic rules. Typically, there are some guidelines as well um, that you don't use a lot of animation. You use none if possible. Uh, you try and keep text to a minimum. You are heavily into <coughs> graphics and layout and placement, and it's all about the story. I'm not alone in my fascination with the water. Most of us are drawn to bodies of water, like oceans and lakes and the pool on the property here. Water is a huge part of my life, and there are many reasons why I love it. The number four has a very significant role in the scene of things for Presentation Summit. Four is the number of maximum hours it's going to take for you if you live in the contiguous United States to get to Minnesota, to MSC Airport. <laughs> My name is Echo Swinford. And uh, yeah, it's an unusual name. I'm the only one in the world. There is no other Echo Swinford. We all thank God for that. Did you know that Buddy Holly and uh, Bob Dylan both had girlfriends named Echo? <laughs> they did. And I am convinced that Peggy Sue was written after The Wrong Woman, about The Wrong Woman, and that Blowing in the Wind was probably about Bob Dylan's girlfriend. As a magician, a professional magician, I'm often asked about stories of magic and illusion, and I love talking about the art of illusion. It's my life. But I found over doing this for two decades that people can only ask certain questions. Well, how long have you been doing magic? Can you tell me how a particular trick works? And can you make my spouse disappear? <laughs> and one of the things in the process for me was writing down the topics for each slot and having just on 20 three by five cards and going through those and just carrying those with me. And then I got rid of those and I just know the slides in my head. But you do have to get it down. I found it was almost a pattern for me and my speaking tone was about three sentences per slide. And in doing this, there's a place in there where I can hover. At the end, I've got like three or four slides where I'm just telling a story, and I can hover. And I'm not really tied to any specific image. It's a really good idea. So it, it helps a lot. <laughs>